Is this real life right now? I just saw this tweet and I started filming because I need to make a video on this, obviously, as a Packers fan. That's okay. So Adam Schefter just tweeted, making sure it's his account. This is very fresh. I'm doing this as I, wow. Wait, did I get, where'd it go? I swear I just saw a tweet from Adam Schefter about Devontae going to the, there it is. Yep, mm mm-hmm, there it is. I was hoping for a second this wasn't true. Blockbuster. Packers are trading Pro Bowl wide receiver Devontae Adams to the Las Vegas Raiders for two prime 2022 picks, league sources tell ESPN. Wow. So Devontae really didn't like that franchise tag, it seems. And so I guess the Packers and him maybe realized they couldn't get a deal done and are deciding to trade him to the Raiders. He joins what his former teammate Derek Carr. Goodness gracious, guys. Goodness gracious. I cannot believe this is real. I really thought Devontae and the Packers would get a deal done. I just can't imagine, goodness, Aaron Rodgers not being with Devontae Adams. Oh my gosh, this is insane. I wonder what the two prime picks are. Maybe as I'm filming this right now, the, um, let's see what it is. Oh, there's more information. Ian Rapport. Devontae Adams gets a new contract worth $141.25 million over five years. Sources say he gets an average of 28.25 average. So that's a lot of money. I'm wondering what the pick is. The Packers get a first-round pick, it says, just now from Adam Schefter. I'm saying this as it's coming out. So Raiders get Devontae. Packers get two 2022 picks, including the Raiders' first-round pick. Get two 2022 picks, including, so that's included in the first-round pick. Golly. I mean, as I've said, I, w- I wanted the Packers to keep Devontae Adams. I just thought having that connection of Rodgers and Devontae there is magical. And even though I know some people were like, he's getting old, we don't need to pay him. Um, I wanted Devontae to stay, so I'm sad to hear of this news. This is sad. Oh, man. I guess that frees up $20 million of cap space. I'm running through the thoughts right now that I'm having. Maybe that, I, I mean, I, I think the Packers need to come in here and, and add a free agent wide receiver right now because right now we got MVS is still a free agent. Maybe we sign him now. I don't know. We got Alan Lazard. So our, our receivers are right now for the Packers. Alan Lazard, uh, Randall Cobb, Amari Rodgers. We, yeah, we need, to, we need to get something done here. I say free agent wide receivers. I don't know who's even out there right now who's a free agent. Maybe the Packers could... I mean, it depends on what picks they're getting. What what pick do the Raiders even have? I don't even know what pick the Raiders have. Maybe the Packers, depending on what picks they get right now, can like move up high and draft one of the top wide receivers in this 2022 draft. I guess that's a possibility as well. Golly, guys. This is crazy. I, I was in pure shock. I was in pure shock when I saw that. I didn't think it was real. I, I really... That was just like a, I literally just placed an order for Chipotle, 14 minutes. I'm probably going to be late to it. Someone's probably going to steal my Chipotle. That happens sometimes. That was just shocking to see right away. And I'm still processing this. Oh, man. Well, guys, I think that may be it for this video. So that way I can eat my dinner. I'll probably have some more thoughts on this once I let it sink in. And man, who, who would have saw this coming? Who? I sure didn't. Maybe you guys, I sure didn't. Huh. Okay. Well, there's that. There's that. Is there any more news before I turn my camera off right now? Let's see if there's any more news before I turn this camera off. Rapport says, this trade has quietly been in the works for days with the Packers and Raiders finalizing deals. A contract extension hasn't worked out. The deal is expected to be completed, barring any late snags. So, man, the Packers, man. Whew, this is crazy. I wonder if Aaron knew this was coming. Did Aaron Rodgers know this was coming? Did he sign that deal knowing Devontae would not be back? That's a good question. Because if he didn't, like let's say Rodgers didn't know Devontae was leaving. No, you he had to have known, right? You would think Devontae and him would talk about this kind of thing, right? I would assume Rodgers would know. <sighs> Who knows? Guys, I'll be out with another video sometime in the next day or so to give some more thoughts once it's once the dust has settled and I'm still in shock. All right. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Feel free to. Goodbye.